with your anchors, London and Trinity. Events at the Beat with Jada and Alasia. And your sports with Joseph and Imani. The Golden Blues starts right now. Good morning, Phoebus High School. Welcome to your Golden Blues where you deliver your daily phantom news. I'm Trinity Daniels. And I'm London Jones. Today is Monday, April 15, 2024, and it is a go day. Thanks for tuning in. Up first for today. Who told y'all to start? I'm just curious. Who told y'all to start? It's, it's, it's already 8.23. Okay. And it's Earth Day is quickly approaching for 2024. It's just around the corner coming up on April 22nd. Not to give out a science lesson, but so far we haven't quite found another planet quite like Earth, huh? <laughs> and we all can play a part in taking care of our planet. Be on the lookout for more information about Earth Day as the day draws near. And now it's time for your clips and activities for the week. We have a penny war going on. Bring in all your loose change. Each academy will have a container for pennies and a container for silver coins and dollar bills. For each penny, your, ac your academy receives a point. For each silver coin or dollar bill, points are taken away. So silver coins and dollar bills you may want to put into other containers. Creative Minds Literary Magazine is looking for poets, writers, songwriters, and artists who would love to showcase their work in their publication. If you are an artist who loves to draw and would like to share your work, Creative Minds would love to publish your work. See Ms. Winfield and C4 for details. Students, teachers, and staff can participate in showcasing their work. Now it's time to see what's happening with the bee. <laughs> Let roll up to the party. Roll up, roll up to the party. Roll up to the party. Roll up, roll up to the party. 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 Roll up to Seniors, the time is drawing near and your festivities are about to pick up. While it's too late to pay for your dues, it's not too late to still par participate in a number of events promised coming up in just in a month. And there's still about 50 tickets left. That's right. And there's open to juniors as well. See Mr. Britt for more information on tickets. Prime is at the historic post office in downtown Hampton and the theme is 24K, so don't miss out. Also, if you are, if you are in an upcoming artist or maybe a music musician or producer and looking for the opportunity to have a free music video created, come down to V14 door first block today or tomorrow to speak to one of our student producers. We are looking talent we are looking for talented music artists such as yourself. Well, that's it for events at the P. Now back to the news desk. Thank you, Jada. And now it's time for your lunch of the day. For today's lunch, everyone will be having burger, pizza, yogurt pack, garden salad, with a roll, yogurt, baked beans, baby carrots, and as always, be sure to grab your fruit and milk. For breakfast tomorrow, everyone is having Pop-Tart Kit, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Strawberry Smoothie, and Emoji Graham Fruit Loop Kit, Baby Carrots, Fruit, and Milk. And as always, we'd like to extend our thank yous to our lovely cafeteria staff and our wonderful custodians. And just a daily reminder, Phantoms, please remember to clean up after yourselves. And now it's time for Mental Health Monday with Sam. Hello, and welcome to Mental Health Monday. I'm your host, Sam Pearson, here to spread some facts about the most complicated organ in your body, your brain. 
Brain development, psychology in general really, is something that I find uber fascinating. Your brain begins its development before you're even born and, reach, and ends when you reach about the age of 25. How? Well, it begins in the back of your brain, turning your inefficient gray cells into the much faster and better white cells, which can communicate with each other about 1,500 times faster. Well, we reach our teens, the biggest question of all, why are teenagers so impulsive, is answered. You see, our brain development has reached the part of our brain, our emotional cortex, meaning that our emotional impulsivity can communicate with the rest of our brain faster than this part, our logical cortex, which is right up here in the front. That's all for today for Mental Health Monday. Have a great week. Make sure to stay safe, happy, and healthy. Back to the news desk. or JV baseball, soccer, and softball play here and take on Hampton as well. The 17th tennis girls have a game home and boys are away. Also, there's a track meet happening Thursday the 18th against Gloucester. Varsity baseball, softball, and soccer are home and JV baseball, softball, and soccer play away. April 16th, soccer girls play away at Hampton and February 19th, or April 19th, soccer plays away at Deep Creek. To all our students and staff, please make time to attend, attend as many events as possible and support our phantom family. To all our athletes, as always, remember to push yourself to be the best you can be for you and your team. Also, if your sport has not yet been talked about while we are in spring sports, please come to B14 and look for Imani or myself to be sure to mention your sport on the morning show. With all this being said, stay tuned for more sporting events, updates, and scores. That's it for sports. Now, now back, back to, to the, the news, news desk. desk. Good. Thank you, Joe and Imani, for your time and information. Now, Phantoms, it's time for Words of Wisdom with our favorite principal, Mr. Coakley. Good morning, Good morning Phantoms. This is Mr. Coakley, Coakley with your Words of Wisdom. Of wisdom. As a these words from the Reverend Jesse Jackson. You're responsible for your books and papers, for completing your homework assignments, and for studying your exams and other tests. As a member of your school community, you also have other responsibilities. You're responsible by the way you treat yourself and others. You're responsible for the choices you make and the actions you take. From the time she was young, television talk show host Oprah Winfrey knew what it was meant to be responsible. Now listen to her words. I don't think of myself as a poor, deprived ghetto girl who made good. I think of myself as someone who, from an early age, knew I was responsible for myself and I had to make good. Today, remember this. Regardless of the circumstances you were born into, you can choose to take responsibility for the outcome of your life. Students, as we have moved into the fourth quarter, we do have SOLs this quarter, so we need to make sure we are in classes on time, we are getting our work, and we are staying on task with our assignments. Phantoms, as always, our purpose is greatness every day and every way. We expect you to show your greatness through your words and actions throughout the school day. Greatness is in every single one of you, and you deserve the education you receive. As always, make today better than yesterday for yourself and others for those wise words and daily reminders. That's it for today's show. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great day and be sure to check back in tomorrow morning for more Golden Blues, where the N stands for news.